what advice uh, do you and other officers uh, try to give to parents uh, as more and more children, even at younger ages, uh, get on to the different social media sites and they might not realize um, the extent of their children's online presence? I mean, it's, it's obviously very important early on to have a face-to-face -face conversation with your child um, before they go online, before they access the app, before they hit the social media website, whatever, have that face-to-face -face serious conversation with them. Tell them the potential dangers. Um, I mean, those of us in law enforcement are, have first-hand experience seeing these cases and investigating them. I can tell kids this is the potential danger, so it's imperative that the parents you know, do their job and sit down and have the conversation, much like you would before you send your child to the park or um, to the to the mall or whatever. You, you talk about the dangers potentially involved and how to respond to those dangers. So, again, it starts with just that conversation, being up front and being blunt and honest about it and making sure that, you know, you also have access to all their electronic devices, to their, their Internet, you know, the, their passwords, um, all that access information. And as the parent, you have every right to have that um, not only to have that, but to take that device and access where they've been, what they've been doing um, in their internet history, things like that. Uh, again, it just keeps, it comes down to being involved in your child's life and having an open dialogue um, between you and your child and make, just making sure that it, it happens frequently as well, that they're reminded constantly of, the, of those dangers and, and pull some real life examples. I mean, there's plenty of them out there, unfortunately. So.